आगे बढ़ते रहो दम Charity Challenge, this event has been phenomenal from start to finish actually. It's been totally different from any one that I've done in previous years. It's been huge. It's, we've had two events in one day. So you can't actually equate to how difficult that would have been. But Alhamdulillah, by Allah's grace, it's been quite comfortable. Record attendance was last year and it was 1,050 of Qadam al without guests. I think we'll be somewhere in the area of 1,900, inshallah. Fundraising was was challenging. It, our fundraising so far, based on last year, again, I guess the historical figures, last year we did 240,000 as you know, and the night before the event last year we were 99,000. Last night, Alhamdulillah, by Allah's grace and really Hazul's prayers, and I'll move on to that in a minute, but we were at 125,000, but that is just for the arm collected. But it's all Hazul's prayers. Hazul I, I gave us was graciously enough to um, give us advice on the National Amla Mulakat and Hazul uh, mentioned just very small but really powerful, beautiful words actually. It was we need to be able to get the people there. So from that we, we drew so much benefit from that that we arranged bus mini buses, we arranged coaches from around the country. And hence the people came and the money came. So everything is is, is is a due cause and effect of Azul's um, guidance for us, actually. When you're here at Willen Lake today, which was one of our many lakes in Milton Keynes, um, and I suspect some of you are quite surprised at how green Milton Keynes it is. It is. It is. Where we're placed in the middle of the country is perfect for everybody to come to, and an hour from Birmingham and an hour from London uh, works very well. It's lovely to see so many of your guys here today. I think it's really important as well, having just learnt about the history over the last few years of the events like this that you've had every year and, and clearly raised more money each year, but most importantly got more people involved each year. Uh, and that's the, the really important thing. And for youngsters to learn at an early age about, about charity giving, but also about healthy things, about working together within a community uh, and just working with each other. And I, I have to say, as I got out of the car and, and walked across uh, past the lake and saw the crowds of people, I couldn't believe how many people here. And it's just it's got a lovely atmosphere about it. Everybody's chatty, everybody's very friendly with each other. Uh, you can see different people supporting different people. Just fantastic. Right, of course, the 10k race is finished now, and we have with us Atal Fatesai. No surprise, it's the Jamia student who's got the second first position for this 10k uh, charity walk. Atal Fatesai, Salaam Alaikum. Alhamdulillah. And very well done. Tell us a bit about, do you train regularly or is it just a one-off thing and you want out of out of blue? Well, with a new site in Jamia, Alhamdulillah, we get more time to train. So, I mean, we train every day, almost. The training that's needed for somebody who wins a marathon, a 10k walk, uh, how long does it take to finish? About four hours? Um, a, a, a marathon is about four hour, hours, but a 10k, the world record is 25 minutes. I, I got 40. So, um, I mean, it takes a lot of training and dedication on a regular basis. Any message for these young kids who would like to join Jamia? Um, please do consider it. Hazur Anwar um, has also stated in his khutbah, uh, especially all the Wakfinor, they should first think about coming to Jamia. Um, especially in this country, we need a lot of um, Rabian and um, Jamia is an amazing place. It's not what you think, it's not just study, study, study. Um, it's a complete package. So please do look into it and come visit Jamia. To keep up to date with the latest videos from the Ahmadiyya Muslim Youth Association, subscribe to the MKA UK Videos YouTube channel. Or for more information about the Ahmadiyya Muslim community, log on to www.alislam.org.